What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. And in today's video, I'm gonna talk about the five outreach strategies that I use to close 20 to 30 high ticket sales a month and how you can too. So whether you're a coach, consultant, entrepreneur, or service provider, and you wanna sell premium packages on autopilot and you're just starting out, or you're an experienced entrepreneur, let's talk about how you can make this predictable and consistent using these five outreach strategies. Now, when I first got started, which was just about six years ago, I was actually a pastor for 18 years and I didn't know anything about what an outreach strategy. In fact, in my world, in the nonprofit world, outreach meant like street preaching. Okay. So we were just used out there making a bunch of noise out there in the public. We didn't have any like strong strategic plans, but when I dove into the world of online marketing and sales, I started seeing that there are techniques and leverage techniques where you only have to do this amount of work and it will move the needle and get you consistent clients on autopilot. This is the exact plan that I would do if I was starting over today. And it's the accumulated wisdom over my six years of closing high ticket sales on autopilot. So let's dive deeper. The number one thing that I would use for outreach is YouTube. So if you're watching me here on YouTube, shout out to you. Thanks for watching and like, and subscribe if I can serve you and keep you encouraged to close more sales. YouTube became the pillar content for us in our business. Why? Because it's a search engine. It's awesome. It's so great. There's long form content that you can produce on YouTube. And what I would do is I'd take that YouTube content, allow it to reach as many people as possible. But then what I would do is I would make all of my other social media content from that YouTube pillar content. I would make shorts, I would make reels, I took sound bites, I make posts. I use all of that and put it on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook reels. I take all the long form and make it into the short form content. The very first strategy is long form YouTube. The next strategy I use is I make all the short form content and I put it out all over social media. Right now, because I don't wanna spend a million hours on TikTok and Instagram and Facebook, I just use the same one minute content and I put it across all platforms. It's pretty cool, right? So from this long form, I'm creating these one minute pieces of content. The next strategy that I use is from those short form pieces of content. I actually have them transcribed and I send out one email a day. So let's talk about email. I read somewhere that 68% of purchasing decisions come off of email. And in our business, email is the thing that drives the most revenue in our business. So cool, right? So from this long form content to the short form, I make daily emails. Now you may say to yourself, Eileen, one email a day? That sounds crazy. Well, think about this. In order for people to purchase from you, they need to know like and trust you. They need to see you showing up consistently. And I love how Jesus said that my sheep hear my voice. So here's my thinking on it. People that aren't meant for me, they don't want to hear my voice. And guess what they'll do? They'll unsubscribe. I heard one guru say that the purpose of email is to have people unsubscribe. But the people who are called to me, who are called to my voice, and the people who are called to you and are called to your voice want to hear what you have to say. Not even if it's perfect, not even if it's revolutionary, they're called to your voice. But here's my question, can they hear your voice? Are you showing up in their email inbox? Are you showing up to bring top of mind? And I'm not saying to send spammy emails. These are value driven content emails that are transcriptions of my one minute shorts and reels. So I hope that's making sense. We're not pitching something every day. We're adding value to the marketplace. At the bottom of my emails, I drop a little PS and I invite them to dive deeper with me. For me, it's an online masterclass where they'll hear more value and have the opportunity to jump in to my premium. So you see the long form, you see the short form, you got the email. The very next strategy that we'll use is we'll actually use ads. Now, what's beautiful about this is I'll actually take the long form and the short form content that I produce and I'll simply film a separate call to action that says something like this. If you enjoyed this video and want to dive deeper, click the link below to get access to my best and free training. That right there becomes the call to action for my ad. So I'll take the video content and I'll add that call to action. And then I have ads running all the time. So you can see how this one piece of leveraged content, this video content 
can become the basis and the foundation for all of your outreach strategies for your business. The fifth outreach strategy that we'll use are guest speakers. So forming partnerships is one of the best and most fun ways to gain consistent high ticket sales. This could look like joint venture partners. This could look like affiliate partnerships. For us, we invite people to be guest speakers at our master classes because most people love to be invited to speak. They want to share their expertise. They want to share their story and they de delighted and surprised to be asked to become a keynote speaker. So I'll say to my friend, hey, do you want to show up and be my keynote speaker at my upcoming master class? And they're like, yeah, and that's so cool. I'm, like, I'm going to make a high ticket offer at the end. Would you like a cut of those sales or a percentage of those sales? They'll be like, yeah, that sounds amazing. Tell me more. I say, cool. They, what we'll do is we'll just do an interview where I interview you and you kind of interview me on your social media platform, like on their Facebook, or their Instagram or their YouTube channel. Kind of easy peasy lemon squeezy interview style. We'll talk about the masterclass. We'll talk about that person and what they're going to share at the masterclass and we'll invite their crew to come on into the party. So outreach looks like this, inviting your friend to come speak and inviting their audience to come along. One of my friends, Lydia did this and she invited her friend to come speak at her masterclass and she made something like 15 high ticket sales just from that one masterclass. I'm not asking you to invite Tony Robbins. I'm just saying, I invite somebody who has an audience that would be interested in your thing and that is a killer outreach strategy. So here you've got five outreach strategies. Go long form YouTube, social media out there on shorts, transcribe those shorts for your email, film separate calls to action. Now you have all these ads out there getting traffic faster. And then lastly, guest speakers. If you'll do these five things, you will definitely close 20 to 30 high ticket sales on autopilot predictably, consistently each and every month. If you're a coach, consultant or entrepreneur and you want to dive a little bit deeper into what the masterclass model looks like for you or what these outreach strategies look like in your business, click the link below in the description where you get access to my best and free training. And I want to thank you for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. I want to keep you encouraged so you'll close more sales faster and more fun. Thanks for watching again. I can't wait to see you in the next video.